Can you balance on one foot for 30 seconds? Seemingly, a majority of the population can't do this. And why this is important at all is we wanna make sure that we can balance because we're walking throughout the day, constantly shifting from one leg to the other. We wanna make sure that we're not running in the risk of having injuries in our ankles, our knees, our hips, our low back. So here's three things that you can do to help improve that one-legged balance. The first rule to work on is actually working on what's called gaze stabilization for the eyes. The eyes play a super important role for your balance. Go ahead and hold your thumb out at arm's length and you're gonna test the fixation in the position straight forward, up, down, left and right, and all diagonals. And pay attention to how your balance is accommodating to that specific position. You'll notice in one of these, I almost lose my balance. That might be something I need to work on in another session. The second drill we wanna work on is taking the tandem stance. Basically, one foot in front of the other. For the tandem stance, standing up nice and tall, feel the weight shift between the front and back leg. This position challenges your balance quite a bit as it's a slight modification to the natural walking position that we have. Shorter stride and the legs are slightly more towards your midline. Pay attention to any imbalances side to side and you might want to spend a little bit more time on the side that's more difficult. The third thing we can do to help improve our balance is actually strengthen the muscles of the lower leg. Bringing the toes together and apart as you go through this or inversion and eversion might take a while before you start to get that burning sensation, but work out to it and feel for any differences side to side. If you found those drills useful to help you work on your balance, go ahead and send us a comment. Leave me a question. I'm always here to help.